Welcome back everybody to second tutorial in threading in Java. So and the first part we just explained to you how to make a symbol thread. And this example we want to extend that to 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 give you uh, much um, understanding of threading, okay? So let me just go to the driver and uh, I want to create other thread or other uh, instance of carpent class. So let's say here B, and uh, let me just make a other thread. So thread T H say C B, C P two, and thread T one. Let's say I want to make other thread T two, and I want to start uh, this thread here and just make two threads: the first thread and the second thread. And I need to start the first and start the second. So just come here and start the second thread. Okay. Okay, fine. So uh, let's let's see what we will have here. Run this in Java. Okay, we have two threads and one in print A, one in print B. You can see here we are printing on the screen. Uh, a B A B because there is a okay you can see here we nice okay we have because we bought a sleep time and we need to wait until all the we have a thousand time uh, printing out okay no problem you can see here we print A we print B we print A we print B and and so forth okay so what about if I if I go because I have started two threads so first time I execute the first thread and go to the second and I you know I just print a print b print a print b a b a b a b so there is a, a a yielding you you can see there is a kind of yielding because sometimes a sometimes b okay and uh, let me just change the 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 sleeping time let me just stop this. And because I put a sleep time here, I need to 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 forget about this. Okay, just go to the driver and run it again. See what we have. Okay, you can see here we have a different story here. We have a different story. Uh, because as you can see here, uh, sometimes the first time we print A. But after that, we print B. We keep printing B, 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 B. Okay, as you can see here, we keep printing out for the thousand time B. Okay, and until we finish, you can see here we finish B. We move to A. So we printed out A for uh, for a uh, 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 you know for a thousand time. You know, you can see here we start A. So from here, from the driver, let me go. We we call the first thread thread one. We started a. After that we started two. So y you can see that thread one has a, a a priority, and after that thread two come out and execute himself until itself until it's finished. So it's interrupted the first thread. Okay. So what about if you need to make or, or put or give a priority? Okay, let's say I want to give a priority for thread number one. So just go T1, the, I'm sorry about this, TH1. What is going on here? Okay, say TH1, the, we have a priority. So we say set priority, okay. There's, you know, this is very important. You can see here we we are given an integer for priority. So if you go to the thread one, we have some uh, uh, some constants like max priority, and max priority is ten. Min priority uh, priority is uh, uh, is one, and we have a normal uh, priority which is five. So I don't want to use these constant. I just want to use uh, an integer. So let's get uh, let's give. Uh, thread one seven priority, and let's give uh, thread number two uh, five the, the five priority. So 
what you what you think which one is gonna start first okay as is, as is, you know by logic the the seventh priority is more than five so I gotta execute seven after this I finish the the seven because it has a much more priority than the thread number two I will continue with thread number five so let me just execute this and see what we have go here Java application okay as you can see here we just started okay started the execution okay and we start the A and after that we start the B as you can see here for a, a period of time we start with B but after that we just give a priority okay we just give a priority to thread one so it take first priority we just keep going keep doing a keep doing a okay so it's in the run time as you can see here we can see that obviously so we keep executing a because it has much more priority and after that we just came to b so what what about if i just want to give this value uh from the beginning i mean i just want to come here and say before i start i just want to give this these two uh, the, the 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 specified priority let me just check that job application started okay you can see here we executed a because it has a the seventh priority it has before we started we give it the highest priority seven we just keep executing a because it has the highest priority okay until we finish for the thousand time we just after this we because B has the second priority we just keep executing B and this is obviously what you what you what you can see here so this is pretty much for this tutorial guys I just want to introduce to you the the the, the type uh, and the priority types from 1 to 10 you can you know blow play with it you can see we bought it before we start and before after we start but you need to be careful about this and need exactly where we should put the prioritization here <laughs> so anyway guys i hope you like it don't, go, don't forget to subscribe the channel stereo 007 a little time with you ahmad nasser see you in the next tutorial thank you